Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play Prison Architect. My name is Weasel, and we're back with the Sweatshop Challenge. So far, things are looking good. We have 34 prisoners in here. They're all injured, and they're peeing. Why are you just peeing? What's, what's happening? Do you need to be put into solitary? It looks like it, but I guess none of the staff is currently working on this. Let's see. 11 out of 15. 11 available. 12 need a break. Well, you can friggin' take a break if you need to. See? They're just going in there, and they're chilling. That's That's excellent. There's also the canteen. I don't know what their deal is. I don't know why they're not getting brought away into the solitary cells that we have here because they, they do exist. Anyways, I also wanted to get some doctors here. Two doctors, go and heal. I know, we don't have an infirmary yet, which makes them actually way more effective because they just run to the next prisoners. They don't even hang out in their pr uh, little cell. They just roam around, see, no reason to even have those. And when they're done, they're just gonna stand in the delivery area. Isn't that, isn't that fantastic? Requires infirmary. Apparently not. Apparently not. What we do need, though, is a morgue. Um, does the morgue need to be enclosed? Indoors. It needs to be indoors, but not enclosed. Hmm. That makes me think somewhat. So what about? I like how they're all running. It's like, bam, eating time, and they're all running. And holy shit, yeah, we're barely making enough food for them. Barely. Yeah, yeah, they can eat. This is all working great. Look at that, 76% fed. They still have some minutes left to eat. And it's over. Whoever didn't eat, that's your problem now. Okay, we have 16 more arriving. I do really hope that we're gonna be starting to see some money income from this. God, look at the utilities. It's awful in here. Uh, in the meantime, let's just get some extra money from grants. Like, hmm, cell block B. Increase prisoner capacity to 50. That sounds good in my books. Let us do this. I think we can do that just by extending this uh, dormitory cell, which I will do. I'll just extend the whole thing like that. Bam. Yeah, that's bam. That's what I said. You can quote me, you know? You can quote me. I don't know who would, who would want that but feel free to quote me any time of the day. Sue, could you could you please remove that? We're gonna extend this, just have one big dormitory cell for all I care. Uh, five staff members are exhausted, one is resting. Let's have a quick look under policy. Uh, staff taking break, we're gonna do that 30%. If it takes, yeah. Oh man, that brings them all down. Oh, they're bringing them inside, that's the reason. Uh, it's 13 degrees, nothing to worry about yet. This requires an entrance. Well, we're just going to dismantle the wall, uh, the mullish walls, and you have an entrance. That's how fast we do entrances. Oh, also maybe a jail door over here so they can run into the canteen. Saves some very important time. Oh, he's angry. <sighs> Great, the chief escapes. Who who escaped? Where? What? What's happening? Where are the escapes? A recent high profile implicated one of our minimum security prisoners as a high-ranking gang leader. They remained under the radar, but now everyone knows who they are. Well, hopefully they kill them for all I care. Jesus, okay. Hey, how about you stop attacking my workmen? Not cool. God, they're angry. All right, taken care of. Let my workmen, let, let, let them work. Okay, I don't know. They must have like slipped through while they were building this. It wasn't very smart of me to do that. So to avoid any further incidents, we're going to build a big ass fence around the parameter. I know, I know, it's pricey. Actually, it's not that pricey. $350 for the for one whole site. That's nothing. That should keep us a little bit safer than usual, I think. Uh, we're gonna put a staff door here. That should actually take care of it. What are you doing? It's work time, so you're working in there. I don't see you cleaning. About that, uh, logistics, how's that coming? Okay, maximum jobs. We're gonna bring this up, bring this up too. Just Fill it all up for all I care. And hopefully people will start learning more and start working the workshop. This is my biggest hope that I have. We do have the program, right? Uh, workshop safety induction, two finished. So, so they are learning right now. Where are they learning? Where are they being taught? What is happening? Okay, yeah, we're gonna bring this up a little bit just to be, uh, get more jobs flowing. Uh, 48 prisoners. Oh, but no cells available because we didn't extend the dormitory uh, over here. My bad. My bad. Classic weasel. <laughs> Am I right? Okay, so we're gonna put some pipes. Pipes, mm hmm sure. We're gonna put some electrical cable over here. And we're gonna have a shit island. Shit island, uh, copyright 2000 something, um, is basically just a little island of toilets in the middle of the room. Why? I don't know. I, I do not know. And there's the king toilet in the middle uh, that all the... Oh, actually, I'm doing this all wrong. I just realized that. King Toilet is in the middle, 
and the other toilets get to stare at King Toilet. This is how we're doing this. I need to make sure that my prisoners, even in the dormitory, have plenty of access to toilets. And we're going to put drains all around this because we don't want any kind of stuff just, you know, being all running down there. And uh, in the middle, they can shower. So it's fun for everyone. It's Poop Island or whatever I called it before. Uh, let's put some weight benches in here as before. That should do it. We have phone booths in there, I think. Might as well put two others in there. And time to put some more bunk beds in. Someone died. Who cares? I have more important things to do. Like, build this ridiculous dormitory. Oh, that must suck. You know, having your bed right next to Poop Island. Ah, oh, fuck, man. The world is really not fair. This kind of became a mix of, uh... The one cell, one big cell challenge and <laughs> anything else. This is going to be great. We're going to have so much room for all of our new uh, workers. Oh, they killed them in the laundry and nobody's cleaning them up? Come on. What's that about? Working? I don't see you working. Anyway, deployment. What we'll do just so we have an eye on everyone, we're going to put guards. Uh, we're going to station them one in every room. Uh, one here as well. Probably a few more in the cells, like six, one in the... And we don't need anyone in there. And one in the kitchen. Wonderful. So we're also going to increase our guards, because we have a little bit extra money on the bank. Up to 30. Insufficient funds. You have insufficient funds. Your mom has insufficient funds. Fine, I'll wait. God, it's hard to make money. Where are the grants at? Oh, the administration center. Sure, that we have that. Uh, I don't have a medical ward yet, and I don't care enough. Prison maintenance. Sure. Hire at least two janitors. Ba-bam. $15,000 just like that. Tool cleanup. Nobody cares. Staff well-being initiative. Ah, fine here. I have at least five guards without assigned duties. Huh? You said duties. Okay, five more. There you go. That's, that's good enough. We're up to 34. Shit, I overdid it. I overdid it. Sorry, I'm gonna have to fire a few. I just won 30. And it looks like uh, the staff break is a little bit too high. How about we bring that up to uh, down to 20, giving us a few more guards. It seems that they are just too exhausted. Uh, deployment. Staff only for the toilet is very important. Where's the other canteen? There it is. Also staff only. We're gonna have to hook up Poop Island to the water system. And man, just I know I know someone who's not going to enjoy this episode. I I, I got a feeling. I got a feeling because of because of Poop Island. Poop Island. Anyways, I I just let myself wander off. Oh, look at that. That's fantastic. I don't need CCTV. It's just to sign a goddamn prison guard to this all the time. That way that nobody escapes either. Oh, yeah. Shakedown. Midnight shakedown. I'm gonna hire a few more guards. Here, 40. Makes me feel better to just have some extra ones around just to search stuff. Look at that. About that, I should probably also take that one grand that's crackdown on drugs and tool cleanup. That's that's excellent. Well, we're gonna find something. I hope. I hope so. About that, we're gonna put some bins for the contraband in. I think they are required to have those around the bins. They're fairly important. And sure, let, why not? Let's put one in the kitchen as well. Everywhere. Well, that was fun. Quick, quick, quick search down. Matt McCauley, sentenced for six years for perjury. Oh, sucks to be you, Matthew McCoy. The state doesn't know much about it. Doesn't now much about him. The NSA put him here. Um, what? The state doesn't know much about him. The NSA put him here. Oh, gotcha. Gotcha. Well, who's fighting? Why fighting? What's with the fighting? Yeah. Mmm. He showers with his with his little uh I forgot what they're called. The friggin' the friggin' hat. The the what's it called? Ah, comment section, let me know. Let me know. And you get a cookie, a free cookie. I'm sorry, you're not getting a cookie. I like how this one workman has to run all the way around to pick a lock that was on the other side of the fence. That's actually glorious. Okay, deployment. Uh, let's see. Prison labor, 18. Qualified prisoner. One whole prisoner is qualified to do this job. We can bring up the 124 prisoners in here. This is beautiful. Okay, you guys keep cleaning. That's excellent. We have one, one prisoner working in here. A single one. The rest gets taught, though. That's good. Yes, workman, a uh, uh, foreman. Behavioral therapy. You know what? Let's 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 give them the opportunity to get some behavioral therapy going because I'm a little bit worried about their moods. Uh, once this is getting like to Foxconn levels, like where they're making the iPhones, 
we wouldn't want them jumping off the building or so. So let's uh, make sure that they get some, you know, behavioral therapy. If it helps, if it helps. Sure, four sessions sounds good. Uh, alcoholics group therapy. We do not have a common room for our um, prisoners. So sucks to be them. Parole hearings. It's a sweatshop. Fine, because we can make money. That's the only. That is legitimately the only reason I'm doing this. Parole hearings because we can make money with it. That is. All I care about is money. Because there's a parole cutoff, if a prisoner has a reoffending rate less than this, they will be released at the end of their parole hearing. How about we bring that up to 50 and, and see what happens? I see no problem with this in the future. God, it must suck to be this guard. That is your whole job is just to roam around in a tiny room with a power station and a water pump station. Talk about the pressing. Man, that must be bad. Oh yeah, I like this. Jeez, I people just peeing inside the laundry room. Okay, enough of this. Enough of this. Put some toilets in here for crying out loud. This is unbelievable. Unbelievable. How are our clothes are going to get nice and clean if you pee everywhere? I actually do wonder if putting toilets in here will make them use the toilets. I think that would be absolutely fantastic. Cleaning cupboard not really doing a whole lot. So are you cleaning this or not? Because I have I have some carts. There you go. Keep cleaning. Beautiful. Nope, they're still peeing on the friggin' floor. You are the worst. Food bladder. They're not using the toilets. I would give you some free time, but it's it's sorry, it's not it's not in the budget. It's not it's not in the budget. I'm so sorry. Remove the supply. I kinda would like to do the tool cleanup, so we're gonna do another shakedown. Just just in case. You can find this. We can do this. I think the kitchen is starting to become a little bit too small. I'm too lazy to build a proper one, so I'm just going to put some around here like that. Yeah, just hook them up like that. That's fine. Three kitchens sound, sounds good to me. And we're just going to put staff doors through here so they can just run through and uh, do their thing. Oh, there's a fight happening. Of course. Of course in the shower. Would you, would you knock it up? No, don't don't knock don't knock anyone out, please don't. That's that's not what I meant. God, words are hard sometimes. Okay. Oh, someone died. Sucks to be that someone. Uh why are we not hooking this up? Too dangerous. That is unacceptable. You know what? That is is a good point though. Under deployment, we have one hour in the day where we eat, which is at 5 a.m. 5 a.m. is a good time to eat, as good as any time. We should be deploying our guards at that point. Yeah, I'd like to have like 20 of them in here. Okay, this, sh this should work out, I think. Um, oh, look at them all working. Yes, make number plates. Make me rich. Yes, please make me rich. Oh, yeah, right, the visit uh, uh, parole rooms. Totally forgot about that. There you go. Is that big enough? Yes, it is. Time to put some electrical cable down. I know, this looks very weird how I'm building this. This is because I'm not going for pretty. I'm going for, for money or something. 6 a.m. to 10 a.m. we have parole hearings. Sounds legit to me. Which means we're going to be deploying a bunch of guards during that, during that time then. Oh, we have 100 people in here? Damn it, they don't even have enough jobs yet. I'm so sorry. Uh, uh, I didn't... I barely... Can keep up with the amount. Oh Jesus! Okay, that oh, it's ruined. Everything's ruined. Stop it! Stop it! Everything's ruined. I think I built too many parole rooms. I'm 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 fairly certain I overdid it a little bit. Needs more cooks. I'm gonna bring that up to twelve. But also we're going to obviously get our prisoners to work. Four here, four here. That's another twelve jobs right there. Excellent. Uh, this is gonna take us some time. The problem with the workshops is they're not learning it fast enough. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove the workshop from this. This, this, this small workshop. Yep. The whole thing. We're going to put something else in here. We have this big workshop over there, which I want it to, I want it to be used to train them. Because there's so many in there, we could just use that one. Look at that. Yeah, there's, there's no more, more room, I think. Maybe. All right, anyway, good idea to start the parole hearings. 6 to 10 a.m. I don't know why. Yeah, there it is. Mm, all of them, please. All of them. Why only four? We have one, two, 
Oh, they're not assigned rooms. For whatever reason, they lost their assignment. Why are you not a room? Oh, you're not a separate room. That's why. There you go. Six parole rooms. And I kind of want to make sure that we're making a little bit of extra money. 75%. You know, a three and four, three out of four chance that they're going to reoffend. I think, I think those are chances I'm willing to take for society. What am I going to do with this room now, now that I have it? Um, we're going to need another workshop. That is, that is certain. More deaths. Oh, you know what? A morgue. Just realized that a morgue, a morgue and an infirmary. We should probably have both. This is perfect. You just bring them over from left to right. No problem. Saves so much time when you don't have to move the dead bodies over. That's so more convenient. If you don't have to go for the whole building. Just, you know, roll it over to the other side. And the other patients know, like, yeah, you, bet, you better get, you, you better heal up. Otherwise, you're going to end like your buddy over there across the room. Pretty sure it also helps when you're alone in that room and you have someone to talk to on the other side. You know, the usual. All right. Tool cleanup is still an active thing. Um, I'm going to go at that in a little bit. For now, I'm still looking at logistics. I like that this is slowly starting to fill up. Uh, they're learning. Uh, maximum jobs, 18, 13, 16? God, I'm bad at math. We have 63 jobs, and no, it didn't take me long at all to count that together. It took me, it took me way too long. Uh, we're going to build some more workshops to deal with the 124 prisoners we're having soon. I think 20 is the maximum size for a workshop, I want to say, but I'm not sure. I kind of have a feeling that it doesn't really matter too much. Um, if the rooms are connected. So what I'll do is I'll build plenty of small workshops that are going to look really ridiculous. At least that is that is my plan. Here, this looks like a good size. Yeah, you have to climb over a table to get into the room, but hey, I mean, that's not a big deal, right? Let's see how many I can assign to this if I go under logistics. Prison labor canned. It's not a room yet. I'm, I'm an idiot. There you go. Workshop. Bam. Four jobs. Wait, what? Four jobs? That's all? <sighs> Fine. I, I have to make this room bigger. Otherwise, it won't count. Ugh. Still only four jobs. This is more complicated than I thought to make big rooms. This is a perfect one, but I can't copy all of this. It won't let me copy all of this. Ah, worst. You know what? I'll take it. Fine. Four, four, four uh, workers. Sounds good to me. I'll, I'll figure this out. Don't you worry. Another workshop. And another workshop. All the workshops. Don't stop constructing. Mm, laundry distribution. Fascinating. I mean, so far, this prison is running fairly well, given that they get like five hours of sleep and one hour to eat. That's probably why. That's the food. It's the food. They have the itis. And then they just don't want to fight anymore. All right, here, put some doors in there. Definitely going to need another uh, utility room because this stuff eats power for breakfast. Or oh, whatever you say. Whatever is the appropriate thing to say there. All right, 15 jobs in these. Damn, that's a lot of jobs. 13 in here. We're going to obviously assign all of them to work in here. Makes me think that I should probably take this wall out and just combine those together. That seems a little bit more reasonable. Also, let's put a metal detector in here. Because that shit's going to be useful. Aha, uh -huh, 18 jobs. Beautiful. So we have 18, 15, and 15. I think that's a good amount of uh, n work places. How about we make one exclusively for saws? Oh shit, I don't have enough money. F I forgot that's a thing. I, I, I totally forgot that. <laughs> Can't even afford tables. Oh no. 
Come on, let's find the, 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 the stolen goods and the stolen weapons. Let's find all of them. Oh, someone died. Oh, shit! Oh, fuck! They, they, oh, they're making a run for it! Oh, I didn't even notice! Oh, shit! Look at that tunnel! Oh, my God! Lockdown! Bang up! 27 escapes today! And they're still running! Oh, no! Oh, no! This is bad! Can I, can I have some? Oh, I can't afford, I can't afford riot police. That's always good. Well, we have 50 escapes today. That's not fantastic. <laughs> if I may say so. Yep, they broke open the door. They were done. They dug out and they ran for it. Great. How about we stop the shake though? Nobody cares anymore. Frick, 50 escapes. Oh, man. All right. Okay, we, we're going to need another uh, layer of security, which I can't afford because I have insufficient fans. Oh, that escape. Oh, that was bad. That was bad. We're going to get a call. Yeah. Okay, we're going to need a bank loan. Really? $2,500? You know what? Fine, I'll take it. I'll, I'll take the $2,500 loan because I need it. Um, we're going to put a gate down. And we're going to deploy guards in there as well once I get to that point. All right, anything else I can do? Cell block C, bring it up to 100. Yes, we can once this room is being fixed. Uh, remove tunnels, please. Thank you. Right now it can't be used because it's not enclosed. The toilets were the problem. They dug out the toilets. The toilets, the toilets. What a bummer. Oh, well. We learned our lesson, or something, something. More shakedowns, more regular shakedowns. What we can do, on a, you know, more regular basis, is go and, where is that? Under policy, uh, escape attempt. First of all, find tools. We can say, yeah, search the cell. If you found tools, search the cell, it's super important. Um, I think that's the only time we're going to do that because they need tools to dig their way out. So if we find those wonderful, wonderful. Hey, can we like heal this guy? Thank you. That's super nice. So he doesn't have to die. Not that I care too much, but I already know I'm going to get a friggin' phone call. I feel maybe I'm not. Also, all of these guys standing here next to the garbage. Uh, makes this whole gate thing a little bit silly. Anyway, $45,000 again, which means we can go back building our workshops before I got so rudely interrupted. Actually, it doesn't cost me a whole lot to build those because I still have a few on hand. Okay, 12, 13, 14, 15 saws. So good. That workshop is going to be glorious. If the power supply can handle it, that is the question. Next, it's time for workshop saws. Oh, we have some presses in here. My bad. Right when I assembled this together. That shall do. And some tables up. Oh, yep. Subsidians of the lands that is... Oh, shit. Destroyed a section of your outer wall. You should have repaired it immediately. How the fuck does this keep happening? Where do we build these prisons that shit just keeps sliding away from us? What is this? Friggin... Worst. Also, why are there tables there? I never said that there should be tables installed. What's wrong with you? Ah, just just working one time with professionals. Working position can't be reached. Well, then dismantle the son of a gun. Um, that workshop needs more. Uh, we're gonna put a bunch of saws in here, some presses. And carpenter tables. Even though we don't have a whole lot of carpenters and it takes a while to learn that, we're still gonna put them in. I don't think we have remotely enough. Alright, that's looking good. People are not overworked and we're making plenty of money. How much? Exports, 4,800 yesterday. That needs to be better. Less, less people working the laundry, less in the cleaning cupboard. I need more people to work in the workshops. The grind. Five interested. I need more people to be interested in this stuff. How am I going to get them to work? Oh yeah, I'm obviously also going to need more prisoners. That's that's for certain. For certain. 
I think we're handling food right now fairly well. I'm going to hire a few extra cooks, bringing that number up to 20 just because I can. And I'm also going to hire a few extra guards, bringing that up to 50. And I want to bring in some go uh, uh, dog trainers. Nearly said god trainers, which is definitely not the thing I wanted to say. Uh, Kennel, where are you? It's hiding from me as per usual. I'm so glad they have a search function. Oh, wait. <gasps> you require dogs? I have not researched dogs. What kind of world is this without dogs? Wait, am I out of money? Ugh, I'm out of money again. This game. This this freaking game. Sh shake down. Get rid of those tools. <laughs> oh, look, our prison is worth minus 2.2 million because so many prisoners escaped. Ah, lovely. Ah. Ah. Former ecological treatment of drug addiction. Hmm. We have, a, we have a bunch of those, don't we? How about we run a few of those? Don't want my uh, sweatshop workers to be on drugs while they operate a saw. That would be really unfortunate. Are you kidding me? Oh, I need more money. Cell block D, 200. What do you want from me? We have a PR disaster. Far too many prisoners have escaped recently and it's your fault. Lock this place down. Oh, wow, you're really up to date. That happened like a million years ago, you bearded son of a Santa Claus. Something, something. Um, yeah, we're just gonna have to be careful. I'm still not sure how we're going to remove the supply of stolen weapons and tools properly. Just keep searching. Oh, perfect. Look at all the meals we have. Why is Feed the Prisoners active at this moment, by the way? I don't really understand who's eating right now. Nobody should be eating for that matter. Huh. Weird. Okay, we have a little bit of extra money thanks to all the grants we just completed. So that looks good. Let's make sure nobody escapes. That would be really cool. Look at them, they're all hanging out in here because they have nothing else to do. This is so frustrating that they're not working. I don't like that. This is unacceptable. Seriously, this is this is rather unacceptable. Also, they're peeing on the floor. Could you stop that? It's really friggin' gross. Oh well. You know what? Just because you don't have a job right now because you can't work in the workshop and the cleaning cupboard is full doesn't mean you get away with this. I'm just gonna build another uh, cleaning cupboard. Yeah, watch me. I mean, seriously, watch me because this is this is how how I get the the, the cash monies on the YouTube thanks to you watching this, watching my stupid antics. It's much appreciated. Seriously, I don't say that often enough. But it's important to be said. So, um, would you mind finishing this up, please? I have sh time is money. I have shit to do. Come on, guys. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, I should totally hook up those metal detectors to each other. Oh, 20 more jobs. There you go. Problem solved. Okay, how many more are roaming around doing nothing? I think they're all busy now. Yep, looks like they're all working. I assign a few more to laundry. No excuses. This workshop is running at capacity. That makes me very happy. I'm hearing, I'm hearing some rebel rabble. Rabble rabble. Oh, someone died in here. Whoops. My bad. Why is not a single guard in here, by the way? Because we, ha we do have them assigned, but it doesn't seem that anyone gives a fuck. See, this is how people die if we don't have guards in there. That's why they're assigned. Why is this insecure, by the way? What What is insecure about this? Oh, is it because of this? The staff door? That might be it. I can totally see that being a problem. Oh, great. More deaths. Why? What happened? Oh, parole. Parole didn't go well, I think. That must have been it. That must have been it. Yep, beat him to a pulp. Make him stop complaining. God, I wish I wish they would I wish they would clean more. You know what? We could create different shifts. We could say at one time they sleep and the other ones work. You know what? We should do that. We should always have someone cleaning. I'm kinda I kinda think that's the better idea. 
All right, there's six hours of sleep, and then you're gonna have some breakfast, and these guys are gonna sleep and have some breakfast, I think. And that way, always some someone's always working. It's exactly how we like it. And maybe we should have maximum security. Um, yeah, let's hang, let's let's put them together with normal security. That is fine. Five hours of sleep. Oh look, you get six hours of sleep because you're minimum security. Ha! Psych! You're not getting six hours of sleep. Don't be silly. Five is more than enough. Plenty. That's plenty. Also, I hope that gives our uh, canteen, uh, our kitchens, a chance to feed all of them properly. At least I hope so. Oh, there they run. They run for their food. Mmm. Hungry little beavers. Yeah. Prison beavers. Don't ask. Anyway, I think it's a good time to end this episode. I don't know. Oh, right. We're gonna need. We're gonna need light. Doesn't even. Doesn't help to have anyone assigned if we have no light. I still don't understand. Oh. Oh, that's why. This is just at this time of day. Ooh. Ooh. That 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 explains things. I assigned them in the wrong way because it didn't tell me. We're gonna need a guard in here all the time. Ah, this is better. Now we see what's going on. I don't even know. Could probably throw a few extra guards in there. I still haven't built a kennel. There's plenty of stuff to be done in the future. Uh, so far, it's going well. Look at that. Export 6,260. That could, that could be better, I feel. That could be better. We're gonna have to cut down those corporation taxes. Ah, that hurt. 50,000 just, just for that, but... Bringing those down is going to increase our profit, and, you know, that's what it's about. Profit. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Prison Architect Sweatshop Challenge. If you did, please give a like. If you have an idea for a challenge, leave the idea in the comments below. Upload the ones you like. You know the drill. Thanks for watching, and Weasel, I'm out, and hope to see you around. Bye-bye! Bow, 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 bow,